Well, now we know why we call them food chains. But what about food webs? This looks like a good food web, right? Mmm, no, I don't think so. A food web isn't an actual web like a spider makes. Just like the food chain, the term food web gives us an idea about the connections between living things and their energy sources, their food. Think about a spider web and how so many parts of it connect and crisscross with the other parts of it. That's how a food web works. Let's look at an example. We can start with our food chain from before. More plants than just grass get energy from the sun, and more animals than just the grasshopper eat grass for energy. And the grasshopper eats more than just grass. Of course, a frog eats more than just grasshoppers. And so on, and so on. And now you can see why it's called a web.